Here it is, the 2023 Honda Pilot fully redesigned inside and out, and there is an increase in cargo capacity. It goes up to 18.6 all the way to 87 cubic feet. But what does that really mean to you? What can you really fit back here in this three row SUV? I'm gonna put the third row up here in just a second for you. But here's the thing. If you wanna know what a cubic foot is, it's the size of a basketball, just a regular size basketball. So that means you could fit 18.6 up to 87 basketballs back here. Let's tell you what that is in a little bit more of a real world number in inches. And because I only have one hand free, I'm just gonna tell you what the numbers are instead of showing you with the tape measure, but just take my word for it or measure yourself. 45 inches wide is what we have here. And from the floor, all the way up here, it's going to be 32 inches. Now, in this case, I can put the tape measure down on the floor and show you that with the rear seats in their upright position, we're looking at 20 inches, and we're going to gain a total of 30 more inches when you lay these rear seats flat. It's gonna go up from 20 inches to 50 inches, and from the floor to the roof right here on the inside, not this area, this was 32 inches high, when you go inside here, you gain another three for 35 total inches of height. And I'm just measuring to the top of the seat that's folded flat right there. Obviously, all three of them fold flat, but you're going to have 74 inches in this case, or excuse me, 78 inches is actually what we wound up with. But there's actually more than that because of the fact that, well, obviously, depending on where the front seats are located, you can increase or decrease that pretty easily. So you actually have quite a few more inches beyond that. I'd say probably 83 to 85. And there you go. The cargo capacity simplified in inches on the 2023 Honda Pilot. If you would like to see me show the same thing on another vehicle, car, SUV, whatever it is, tell me the make and the model and I'll make that happen for you. Thanks for taking the time to watch, guys. We'll see you next time. To learn more about the model in today's video, visit the link in the description for a detailed comparison between trims and pricing for the vehicle we featured or any vehicle you may be interested in. These pages feature information such as our recommended trim level based on price, value, and features. Thank you for taking the time to watch today's video. We look forward to seeing you next time.